to the south of France. Everybody, welcome back to my channel. For those who don't know me, my name is Mia and this is my channel. Today, I actually have to run to rehearsal soon. I'm so happy I get to say that because I'm finally here. It's been a long year and I'm finally here. But I have to run to rehearsals in a minute. So I wanted to give you guys a little long story short about where I've been. And then I'm gonna take you guys along with me in my day. A few days in my life, is, I guess. Yeah, yeah, I, I think that makes up for me being gone, right? Yeah, okay. The last time I uploaded, it was a Get Fit With Me vlog, and that was around three months ago. Well, three months ago, it was, what, April? March, it was March. Uh, my parents came, they helped me move out of my California California apartment and then I moved home back to Georgia. Georgia for a little bit, unpacking my stuff. I wasn't doing anything, literally just like getting ready for France. I know I should have probably like recorded that, but it was basically just me shopping. Like I needed like new outfits to dance in and everything and sneakers to walk in because I basically walk everywhere if I don't take the train, no car, no moped, no bike, like I literally just walk everywhere. Yeah, it was just me shopping. I didn't do anything, so I didn't vlog or record anything when I really should have because I pe I like I want to see that when people are moving, but I guess I didn't know how to record it. I don't know. I'm making lists of excuses. And then I got the vaccine. I got sick from the vaccine, so I wasn't able to move back in April. And then now I'm feeling better, obviously, fully vaccinated. And here I am in the south of France. And I'm so happy I get to say that. Like, I'm literally just looking at my view. It's not really like the most exquisite view or anything, but like, you know, it's, it's a view. I'll show you. This is my cute little view. Anyway, on the agenda for today, I have to, did I stutter? I think I did. the agenda for today i have to take a 20 minute walk to my rehearsal space and it's a very cute little lengthy walk might i add because like where i'm going it's like the historical part of the city that i'm in in montpellier and there are a whole bunch of hills a whole bunch of hills and i have to go up and down at least like four hills or something um and then after that i literally have rehearsal for five hours i come back home in my little humble abode my little studio apartment that is also a hotel because I need to find an apartment which is also on the agenda for today and then I come back I write in my little planner of things that I have to do also currently I am reading this clever girl finance 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 wow that was aggressive it's called clever girl finance it's by Bola Sukka Booney, something like that. It's really good. I'm almost done. I think I have like two or three more chapters left. Here's what I came for. My planner. This is my planner for this month, month of June. So that's my planner. And usually I write in it every Sunday for the week, but because my days haven't been the same here just exactly yet, I don't write in it until the morning, which is now and i don't have anything in there yet because all i have today is rehearsals and i didn't work out today because i had to go downstairs and let the cleaning people clean my room actually i kind of went for like a cute 10 minute walk to this little park that's across the street and then i came back and then i was looking for apartments did i even finish what i had to do today hmm huh. i don't think so take two of what i have to do today I'm a mess. So what I have to do today, rehearsal. After rehearsal, come back. I will write in my daily devotional. I will look for apartments. I will answer emails. 
have to translate a ticket because I leave the 13th to go to a different city for more rehearsals. Like we change city, wait, hold on, back to task. After I translate the ticket, I will read, I usually read that book or I read a Wattpad story like a Harry Styles fan fiction or I watch TikTok. I think that's it, to be honest. Yeah, I think that's it. Get ready for bed. I'm gonna go to bed, wake up the next day and have a whole new day. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so right now I'm gonna get ready. Even though technically I am ready, I just have to like pack my bags. This is not a cute flattering light but that's okay so i have my phone attached to this little string lanyard thing because i don't want to place my phone anywhere and then misplace it and not be able to find it or have somebody take it while it's in my pocket or my bag or anything so i have it attached and i just go i sling it across my body um my backpack is lululemon shirt lululemon bra lululemon waist trainer target pants lululemon and i'm wearing my yellow nikes and watch apple watch but that is my outfit for today i look like a dancer but i am a dancer so that's okay also please excuse my eyebrows i'm learning how to use the anastasia clear brow gel thing and i got some bushy eyebrows so i'm still learning how to use it but yeah I don't know if you can hear me, but I literally just witnessed this girl slap the crap out of her little sister. Like, her little sister was just sitting there calmly at the edge of a bench or whatever, and she just comes up, slaps her, and walks her back towards the park. Turns out that my 20 minute walk turned into being a 25 minute walk and it's 88 degrees outside. You guys, 1.26 miles later, I'm here. Sweaty. This is my rehearsal space for the rest of this week. I'm about to eat some pretzels and an orange before I start warming up and getting ready for my rehearsal. I wanted to mention that I keep pepper spray and a knife on me at all times in my pocket or in my purse whenever I'm walking by myself safe or at least I feel protected and safe I'm sweating I'm here my choreographer showed up same time as I did so I definitely need to get here early next time earlier ouch yeah I need to get here earlier next time so I can warm up longer I just did a quick five minute ab ouch this hurts the ball is right below one of my glutes um to help open up my hips i looked at my watch i was actually walking for 30 minutes not 25 so definitely need to get here earlier because i did leave exactly at the 13th hour which is one o'clock i'm going to do some jumping jacks, run in a circle, and be ready for rehearsal, and I will see you guys after. My eyebrows are so thick and bushy, okay, so ignore that. But update on literally what happened to me yesterday. After rehearsal, came home, didn't want to like vlog on the way back because it was the exact same thing, and took a shower and I knocked out, and now it's the next day, so sorry <laughs> good morning you guys today is a new day i have a mountain on my face and i have a few more growing because of maskne 
and i hate to say this but wearing this mask sucks only because i get my mask made so right now i'm currently writing in my planner um just what i have to do today and for tomorrow because it's going to be a very busy busy weekend so i have to pack today from my big behind blue suitcase that's like 30,000 feet tall it's not that tall i'm like 5'2 it's probably about like three and a half feet tall but i have to pick outfits from that suitcase to put it into my cute little zebra suitcase right over here because i am moving cities this weekend um with the company that i'm touring with because it's time to change cities i guess he has different cities planned um each month that way we i guess it's because that's we'll, where we'll be touring quote unquote um anyway yes i have to pack saturday is going to be pretty exciting because i plan on doing a cute little weekend vlog because i am going to be exploring where's my packets oh they're over there um i have two maps of montpellier and one of them is just like all of montpellier and where you like directions and everything and the other one is like tourist attractions so it has like um beaches and a whole bunch of other places shopping malls tourist attractions so i plan on doing that on saturday and then on sunday is when we plan on changing cities so I'm coming from, or going to, I can't pronounce French anything, Thonin, Thanin, Thonon, one of the two. So I'll be coming from, or coming from Montpellier, going to Thanin, Thonin, and then I change to another city a week after that. So I'm pretty excited about that. I'm really nervous because everything's in French and I have to translate the tickets and everything. So wish me luck because it's gonna be stressful and hectic. Okay. So after I'm done writing in my journal, I'm about to tidy up a little bit before I look at the videos because I learned more choreography yesterday and we only did it, well, so somebody did it for me. So I watched, I learned it, I did it once, we moved on. And then there's other choreography like my solo slash duet that I ended up doing multiple times. But they're the ones that I've done only once that I need to go over because I still don't have it yet. And I literally have today and tomorrow before I come together with the rest of the company and we start doing a full out. So wish me luck because this is, this is hard. I know this is what I signed up for, but man, this is... This is hard. Anyway, I'm gonna do that real quick. Write my journal a little bit as well because I got some things on my mind. I also just wanna manifest because it's, I realize that manifesting also helps me have, just like journaling, clearer thoughts. But for me, when I journal, whatever is on my heart, whatever is on my mind, I just put it all in writing and then I'm fine. But manifesting, it helps me clear my thoughts of what I want to do, what I need to do. And yeah. And I've been taking... Man, let me tell you. Look at, look at this. Vitamin C. PDA. Food enzymes. Elderberry. Probiotics. Elderberry. Elderberry. There it is burdock root oh i have more stuff somewhere but i i don't remember where i'd go lots of vitamins gotta keep myself healthy where's my oh it's on the bed i have turmeric and ginger over there as well um you know gotta keep my body healthy gotta keep my digestive system intact all i need is um garlic i think and a few other things yeah. Mm -hmm. um, but I'm also on the hunt for some sunscreens. So if you have any sunscreen recommendations, leave it down below. I would greatly appreciate it. I heard a lot of good things about like Neutrogena and I've used Neutrogena before, 
but I wanted to try that black girl magic or black girl sunscreen that they sell at Target, but they don't have a Target here. So when my mom comes to visit, I think I might just ask her to bring it for me. This is, so this is today's outfit. It's a Yeezy shirt that I got at Melrose Trading Post. And then these sweatpants I got from Aerie. And then I'm either gonna wear, ignore the trash, um, my Converse or my Nikes. I can't really decide. I think I'm gonna go with the Nikes because I wore the Converse yesterday. Wow, my eyebrows are real thick. Okay, I gotta go. I'm running a little bit behind because it's about a 33 minute walk to 45 minute walk. I think I mentioned that, not 45, no. It's like a, it says 25 minutes, but I walk slow. So it takes me roughly around 33, 35 minutes to get over there. Yeah, I gotta go because I have to get lunch as well and get more water because I'm almost out of water here. So, yeah. Oh, and I wear this hat today so I can, ouch, avoid the sun. I made it. I'm so hot and sweaty. And then I wore this on the walk here, which is 1.4 miles. Hold on, let me stop this. I'm exhausted. My pimple hurts and it's gotten bigger. But I'm about to warm up and stretch. Get ready for a rehearsal that starts at 1. It's currently 12.33. I have some alone time, finally. So, not finally, but... When I was in here yesterday, some people decided to come in and mop the floor since it was disgusting. And then my partner showed up, so he and I discussed what we're doing. I'm here, and it's the AC's blowing. I'm lucky and happy to be here. That's all I gotta say. I literally just walked through the door. I'm so tired. After rehearsal, they invited me to a... <gasps> Look at the sunset. That is so pretty. Okay, anyway. After rehearsal, they invited me to a well, art gallery. We stayed there for a few hours. Few meaning like two. Um, they all spoke French, but they all loved when I spoke English. Um, well, not all, some of them, and they spoke English back to me, um, like greetings, you know, hello, goodbye, would you like some wine, that type of stuff. And then we walked back, so total I walked today are roughly around four miles, and that's just like average of how often I walk, but I just walked in, I'm about to shower, heat up, dinner, oh, I need to pack all of my activewear into my little zebra suitcase which is packed underneath this little cubby right here and then get ready for bed oh and write in my journal again and write in my planner of course and stretch and get ice from the concierge because my feet hurt ice ice baby i just got out the shower and i put in my dinner it's something jumbo cheese I guess it's giant mac and cheese. My hair's a mess. I know I have my shower cap on, but I'm heating up dinner and then I'm about to pack, but I don't know what to pack, but I'm going to eat first because, you know, it simulates brain activity or something like that. And I don't know what to pack. I know I need a pillow, maybe, but I don't want to lug that around. Maybe I do. I love my pillow like y'all y'all don't understand my pillow goes with me everywhere no matter what road trips airplanes you name it it's going on trains now um but this big behind suitcase right here i have to lug across town and to put it in um their office so i don't have to take it with me so i can just take my small stuff easy things that can travel my arm hurts so i'm going to put down my camera Hopefully my mac and cheese is done, watch some videos, and then I'll pack. 
I literally haven't done anything but play on my Switch and watch YouTube videos. But I need to get up right now because my Heidi's going to bed and I can't go to bed yet because I have a gav. I have an early morning tomorrow. I have rehearsal at 11 a.m. instead of 2 p.m. me contemplating life right now i'm happy to be here i had to remind myself you're happy to be here you are blessed to be here you are blessed to have traveled to a different country and move by yourself be happy that you're able to have what you have okay i think i'm gonna take a nap <laughs> no no, I'm gonna get up. Let me just finish this YouTube video. I only have 16 minutes left because I'm only 54 minutes, 54 seconds in. Um, yeah. Also, let me finish my task on Animal Crossing and then oh, I gotta get up. Take some Advil too because I'm in pain. Yay, 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 yay. I'm finally getting up to pack. It's been roughly two hours later since I last spoke to you guys. It's pitch black outside. My curtains are down because I don't want to see, I don't want anybody to be able to see into my hotel room. Um, I'm about to turn these lights. I gotta get this done because I'm tired. All right, I need dance clothes, my toiletry bag, underwear, pajamas, which is what I'm wearing, socks, uh, they're dirty, but I'll wash them. Hopefully there's like a laundry room there. And... My Switch, my laptop, and my, my planner, and my books, and my crystals, and my vitamins. Okay, list. I'm gonna come back to this video as I'm packing so I can remember what I just said. And tampons and liners, and pads. I wear pads to bed because it's not good to wear tampons to bed. It's what I've been told. I used to sleep with a knife. Next to me at all times. Um, because I don't want I don't want anybody breaking in. So I have one on deck. Would I tell you the hold oh, my hair's a mess, give me a sec. The amount of pads, tampons, and masks that I own and tea bags is absurd because I literally came to France prepared because I don't think they sell my organic tampons, but now I know they sell always, I think it's what they're called, always, these pads, whatever, but you ready for this? And that's not even half of it. That's literally not half of the pads, the tampons, and the masks that I own. I literally have a whole other suitcase full of them. And my tea bags, like, I was afraid that they didn't have what I like to drink, what I like to eat, what I like to eat, what I like to drink, my tea, and my type of liners, pads, tampons. I knew they had masks, but I wanted to come prepared for masks in case, like, you know, I don't know, stay ready, don't get ready is all, what I like to say. As my friend Damon likes to say, stay ready, don't get ready. So this is my, also my gloves, that's also not even half, and my 3D crest whitening strips. But this is my somewhat empty of a suitcase. Now I have to put together, let me put my toiletry case in first to make sure that I have space for everything else and depend like it literally depends on if I want to like what if I bring my pillow cake my pillow I'm not bringing my roller if I bring my roller I'm not bringing my pillow because I ain't carrying both because I don't
I'm a star. I'm gonna try try to make all of that fit in there. You think I can make it happen? All I can say is wish me luck because that's a lot of clothes, Mia. But I'm packing for two weeks. We'll see. Good morning. It's the next day. I finished packing. Sort of, um, I kind of just shoved the rest of everything in there when I realized it was midnight. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so tired. And it's like 7.30 in the morning right now. I have to get up early so I can lug that big behind blue suitcase across town so they can hold it for me so I don't have to worry about traveling with it. I don't know if I said that already, but if I am, I'm repeating it. You're welcome. But I'm going to take you guys along with me again today, even though I'm doing the exact same thing. Just earlier, hours earlier, um, and then we can explore Montpellier. Or should I save that for a weekend in my life? Because I will be exploring tomorrow and um, Sunday is the day I travel. So, <gasps> my pimple. It's gone. Yeah, actually, I think I might end this vlog off here and say a couple days in my life and then start a new vlog saying a weekend of my life. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel and I will see you literally in a few seconds.